train. So just to update you, last week you saw how we got tough with our new manager. How we sold 500 tickets for our showcase gig in six days. How our drummer had a brush with a corrupt and power of drugs. How we overcame adversity at our showcase gig, pulled together and embraced massive mixes top A&R man, Slick Sloan, with our hospitality. Yeah, big <laughs> and went on to play the best gig of our lives, swinging a record deal and a chance for the big time. That was us, jocks were here, stand back world. We're coming through. <laughs> On the road with your band. What a buzz, man. Free as a bird. Roaming the gloaming with your mates. Riding your big white coach to the Golden Line streets of the music maker in the south. Destination, London. <laughs> so you lunge and twist. And when you twist it, it minces all that guts up. So when you pull it out, it brings all the entrails where there's blood everywhere. Muscle and sinew in it all hanging out of my shoulder. My arm is just hanging off by the skin. The fuel station's on out of anaesthetic, so they've just sewed it back on, there and then. Oh aye. Who did I tell you about the time that tank ran over Big Shuggy McStrip's heat? Talk about tomato soup. Excuse me. Of course, when you're starting out, you expect a degree of discomfort and inconvenience. But it doesn't matter, as long as you know that everyone's in it together. Bloody terrible. How was yours? Ah, you know, could have been better. What the hell are they doing here? I thought I told you to get rid of them. What? Oh, God, you haven't told them, have you? Told us what? Hi, Mr. Stone. All right, son. How are you doing? Great. I bought a new base with my student loan. Chucked in college. And my dad's disinherited me, but who cares, eh? What? Why are you all looking at me like that? Have you got something to tell us, Jez? Well, I was going to mention. It's at moments like this that your manager is invaluable. They know how to approach a tricky subject with tact, understanding, and sensitivity. Psycho, you can't play. You're as ugly as sin. You've got plukes. You're out the band. You bastard! Your best friend. You can't do that. I'm sorry, but Slick Sloan doesn't like you, Psycho. And if the record company doesn't like you, well, that's it. End of story. Oh, just hold on. Slick Sloan doesn't see who's in this band. Aye, Psycho's ugly. Aye, he's a stupid, dim-witted, fiendian bastard. Some things you just can't help. But there is nothing wrong with his playing. And if there's one thing worse than a stupid Catholic bastard, it's a stupid English bastard. So you can tell this Slick Sloan that if Psycho's out, so am I! Thanks, Wally. Appreciate that. There's no easy way to tell you this, Willie. Oh my God, you're out too, Willie. I'm sorry, but there it is. You don't 
don't think I agree with this, do you? Look, the guy was pissed. He'll never remember who was in the band. We can't take that chance. He only wants the songwriting team and the girl with the big tits. The big what? Talent, big talent. Look, Joe, I didn't make the rules of show business, but we all have to play by them, you know? Well, you can play with whatever you like, Art. <sighs> Stay are in. Ah! Where are you going? Hey! Come on, Willie. Psycho. Let's leave the big songwriting man to it. It's no fair. If he told me I needed tax, maybe I could have done something about it. God's sakes, can he do something? Wait! Remember, managers are there to get you out of trouble. Make them work for the money. Can you get me a hanky? You break my friggin' heart. London. City of Sin, the beaten, throbbing heart of the global entertainment industry. The home of hip. A buzzing hive of celebrity. There's fame and famous people here. If only you know where to look. Good to see you're still in the business, Chegger. Uh, you can't keep a good man down, Mr. Stilton. That's true. That's true. Oh. oh, a quid. <laughs> oh, thanks very much, Gov. You're real tough. Prick. Art's plan to get Willie and Psycho back in the band was simple, audacious, shite. It could just work. Here we are, babies. Massive mix. Chance of a lifetime. A lot of folk are somehow under the impression that record companies are romantic, glamorous places packed with some of the sexiest babes walking the face of the earth. Well, you know, they're right. Mr. Silton, he's been expecting you. If you'd like to take a seat for a moment. You know what's funny? Some people just seem to have the knack. Instinctively, they're at home in the high pressure world of the rich and beautiful. Hey, babe. I'm a lead singer. How interesting. Sorry about my friend. He can't help being an immature, sexist prick. Yeah, so I see. Lizzie, my little kitten. Chai! Come here, you sex pot give us a song. <laughs> mm. Mm. They've been playing your new video all day and you look so sexy in it. I know, <laughs> I know. Uh, Lizzie, be a little flower. Take this to Mark for me, would you? Yeah, no problem. You're my little angel on a stick. What are you? <laughs> your little angel on a stick, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> Must be a post feminist. What's that then? Does it matter? Let's shag it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. For those here that fancy a job in a record company, you have to be prepared to turn your hand to all manner of jobs, starting at the bottom and working your way up. Um, Chuck, do I hate? That's us, doll. Um, my name's Kiki, and I'll be taking you to the lift. Hi, I'm Dee Dee, and I'll be taking you to the sixth floor. This is Mimi. She'll be taking you down the corridor to Mr. Sloane's office. Nice job, isn't it? I'm tremendously lucky. The great thing is, you don't need any particular qualifications. Here the sky's the limit. Sound. As long as you're totally gorgeous. This is Kaz. She'll be making your Hi. coffee. Hi. That's Maz. She'll be hanging your coats up. Hi. This is Zaz. She'll be giving blowjobs, smiling and being encouraging. Hi. And that's Daz. Hi. What's Daz do? Laundry. Art Stilton! You big baboon's bollocks! Slick, yeah, we balded bastard! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's good to see you, Art, man. Good to see you too, Slick. <laughs> oh, 
Kaz, coffee, Maz, Coates, Zaz. I think they'll need a little bit of encouragement. Art, I'll be with you in five minutes because I'm on the phone to Jarvis Cocker. Send them in. Jarvis, Jarvis, piss off. You know I love you. <laughs> Bye. Guys, 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 park your asses up. So, Art, you big fart. <laughs> 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 You've done it again. You bought me some major new talent. Ain't no doubt about it, Slick. And you've got rid of the two crap ones? Sure did. In fact, we've already replaced them. Really? Yeah, after oh, extensive additions. In fact, the other two will be here any minute. Great. Can't wait. Do you want to hear the new demo, Slick? Love to. I think you'll like it. Whole new sound. Completely. say the difference is shattering what do you say that shattering shattering I mean this is so much better much much better aha I hear they are slick this is Kirk solid and Drew McStew that's right Drew McStew I bought the coffee uh, we were just saying guys how much better the band sounds now we got rid of those two no-hopers. Um, what were their names again? Wally McBoyne and Psycho McPhail. Huh? You, you, you knew them? Aye. Sort of. Well, they're history now, huh? Who cares about them? Thank goodness. My God, that drummer, what an ugly-looking bastard. Huh? Ah! Oh, sorry, Drew. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Oh. Here, let me help. Oh, no, no, you're all right, Dan. Oh, no, honestly, I say. That's nice. Thanks, I'll get that one. <laughs> Cheers. It's quite all right. Are you all right? Aye, just a wee bit damp. So, let me tell you guys. We really love your Celtic sound here at Massive. We are looking at a serious commitment long term. This is no bullshit. We love you jocks. Yes, it's that serious. We love you. Well, we certainly appreciate that, Slick. Rock Speak, an occasional series where we find out what they're really saying. Let's take a look at that again. So, let me tell you guys. I think your music is a complete bag of shite. But everybody is signing Scottish bands just at the moment, and you lot look just gullible enough for us to make a few quid. Now, if you mess up, we will drop you so fast that your bollocks won't touch the sides. Well, we certainly appreciate that, Slick. Art, let's do the talk. This is the key moment. You're now talking about the record company advance. The next few moments could be the most important of your whole career. So broadly. 200 grand. 140. 170. 50. 60. Dunk royalties. 15%. Bullshit. 